Kenya and the United States aim to strengthen their partnership in improving security, Defense Cabinet Secretary Aidan Dwali said on Wednesday. This is after the CS held talks with U.S. counterpart Lloyd Austin III on regional and global security matters. Our discussion also centered on increasing our efforts on the war against al-Shabaab and the need for security and stability in the Red Sea and Bab al-Mandeb, he said. Dwali was hosted by Lloyd Austin III at the Pentagon where the two discussed a host of issues on the implementation of the defense cooperation framework between the U.S. and Kenya on strategic partnership. On his part, Secretary Austin expressed his gratitude towards Dwali for Kenya's role and contributions to regional and global security. He also emphasized the need to stabilize security in other regions in Africa. There is a need to continue the fight against al-Shabaab and the need for security and stability in the Red Sea and Bab al-Mandeb, Austin said. He also commended C.S. Dwali for Kenya's role and contributions to regional and global security. In addition, both leaders agreed to continue working together to address shared regional challenges. Dwali's visit follows the signing of the Defense Cooperation Framework on September 25, 2023, in Nairobi, aimed at strengthening the strategic partnership between Kenya and the United States. The CS who is on a working visit to the U.S. discussed with the senators and other officials an array of issues revolving around regional security. During a meeting with Under Secretary of State for Political Affairs, Victoria Nuland, Dwali said they held talks on how the two countries can step up cooperation in the fields of defense. They also discussed regional security and how to ensure stability in the Horn of Africa. We held talks on how Kenya and the U.S. will expand cooperation in the fields of defense including regional peace and security in the Horn of Africa and the Great Lakes regions, he said. On Tuesday, C.S. Dwali also met and held talks with Texas Senator John Cornyn on possible partnerships, especially in terms of military training. Senator Cornyn is a member of the U.S. Senate Select Committee on Intelligence. We discussed some areas that our two countries can collaborate, including military training and peace security and regional stability, Dwali said. In another meeting, Dwali met Senator James Lankford, a ranking member of the U.S. Government Operations and Border Management at Capitol Hill. Washington, D.C. The CS is in the United States for a four-day official visit.